it's, it's reliable. All right, I, I appreciate that, Dave. Thank you. My turn for carpool, and then I've got to go to the... What's going on? A friend of mine at the AP said they're digging into Marilyn's estate. They found evidence linking her to Jack. Oh, God. It's been a year and a half since she died. I just won't let it go. Are you going public with it? No, they'd like to. He was just giving me a heads up. I had to make some calls. In other words, clean up after Jack? Again? Yeah, if you, if you want to put it like that, I suppose. You're Attorney General, Bobby. You don't find it a little degrading? No, I, I don't find it degrading. It's my job. Uh, it's my job to protect my brother. Besides, I, I recall uh, at the time you telling me to be Attorney General. Exactly. Not Jack's Mr. Fix-It. You can't keep doing this. It's beneath you. And it's eating you up. No, no, it's, it's not eating me I up. I can but clearly see it it's, is. it's eating at you. Listen, when, when he comes under attack, uh, that, 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 that becomes my responsibility. Okay, what, what, what do you want me to say? He's my brother. And you're his. He owes you a little respect. He shouldn't be asking you to do this kind of thing. After all this time, I thought you understood what it meant to be a Kennedy. I've given you eight children. Just when do I qualify? to liven up that soda pop for you. Maybe a cherry? No, 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 I'm fine, Peter. Don't let him tease you, Bobby. He's just playing the part of Peter Lawford. It's part I play rather well. Well, maybe Sinatra will hire you for his next picture. <laughs> that why, why didn't you tell me Marilyn Monroe would be here? She's always here. Well, then I shouldn't be here. You're my brother. Why wouldn't you be here? She's been with Jack. If we stopped seeing everyone who's been with Jack, we'd have no friends. <laughs> no, Peter. Marilyn! Pat, I, I don't want to... This is a bad idea. I don't enjoy yourself, here. Bobby. It's a great party, kids. Marilyn, meet Monsignor Kennedy. How are you? Hello. Mr. Attorney General. I, uh, I, I admire your work. Let's all have a drink. Uh, Bobby doesn't drink, um, he doesn't smoke, and he doesn't cheat on his wife. Are you sure you're Jack's brother? General? Oh, well, it's um, challenging, certainly uh, difficult at times, but mm -hmm. uh, I, I find it uh, very, very gratifying, really. Oh, I was just kidding, silly. I don't care. Mm. <laughs> How was, um, how's it for you, being, uh, being an actress? Is that what I am? Well, I, I think so. Come on, relax, Mr. Attorney General. <laughs> My my dad was uh, a, a producer in the twenties mm -hmm. in uh, Hollywood. Really? In fact, I uh, I once uh, I received a six gun and holster from Tom Mix. And, uh, he would uh, come home uh, from Hollywood and tell us uh, all sorts of stories. Oh, like what? Well, um, just how uh, people in your business are different from everyone else? If we were the same, no one would pay to see us. Oops. What? Oh, no. What did you... I think I lost my earring. Oh, um, I don't... Uh... Ha <laughs> ha
Good. You found it. There you are. Thank you, Bobby. Taking me home. There you are. <laughs> yeah, Ed, just give me a minute. Yes, sir. Ooh, it's chilly. I think I'm gonna build a fire. A nice, big fire. And then I'm gonna take off all my clothes. There's nothing better than lying buck naked in front of the fire. Don't you think? <laughs> Is everything okay? Marilyn's driving me crazy. She is crazy. She called me 15 times this week, each time less coherent. It's bizarre. She says that uh, sleeping with the president is her uh, patriotic duty. She wants to be a, uh, a good soldier. So tell her to go join the Marines. Then, this goddamn thing. I mean, Bobby, that is just, that's way out of line. God damn, it says Jack with love always. I know what it says. Just get rid of it. Melt it down, hide it, I don't care. Jack, she is too volatile. You need to end it with her. I tried. Of course, I can't call her. Be on the White House log. Can you talk to her, Bobby? She likes you, she'll listen to you. No way, this is your mess, you deal with it. Bobby. No, no. I no. I live in the real world, Jack, where, where wives get upset when uh, their husbands visit Marilyn Monroe. I'll never ask you to do something like this for me again. God. You have my word. He said he wants to leave, Jack. No, he no. told me again just no, the other... He, he said I'm no. all that he lived he for! He never said any of those things, Marilyn. Were you there? <laughs> you don't know what he wants. And you're turning him against me because... Because you're jealous. Because he's with me. And you're not. No, no. That's all make-believe. You're living in a dream world, Marilyn. I'm not making it up, Bobby. I know what you're feeling in your heart, and I know you think it's real. But what he says to you in passion and what he really means are two different things. You're a beautiful, gifted girl. <sighs> You need to focus on your career. You said we would get married? No. No, he promised no, me, No, there's Bobby. no marriage. It's over. I want to hear it from him. I want to hear it from him. <laughs> Forget about Jack. You're asking me to forget about the man I love, the man I want to have babies with. There is no future for you and Jack. You need to accept that. You need to accept that. Bobby, can you just let me talk Listen to me? Listen to me. Please. 
If you try to reach him, we will turn this around on you. We'll make him innocent and you'll be the home wrecker. We're trying to blackmail the president. No studio will hire you. It's over, Marilyn. But he loves me, Bobby. Goodbye. And yet, it stares at envy. Who does she think she is, Marilyn Monroe? <laughs>